Hey everyone, we are back in the craft room and I just did a pendant that I'm letting dry and I wanted to make a matching ring. And I'm just using the jewelry clay and I have two balls of the A and the B of equal size. And all I'm going to do is blend it until it's fully mixed. I have this ring blank that I wanted to use this last connector I had to match the, the pendant that I just made. I have the clay all blended and now I'm just going to roll it into a ball and I'm going to attach it to the ring blank. I'm going to put it right in the center and then I'm going to just pat it down. Okay, and then I'm going to take this last piece that I have, whoops, center it on there, squish it down a little bit so the clay can grab it. And then I'm going to take a white crystal, put it right in the center like I did on the pendant. I'm going to squeeze it down just a little bit. Okay, and there it is. And then I'm going to take the pigment powder, then this shocking blue. They say it's turquoise, but it looks like a shocking blue to me. And I'm going to rub it on all the exposed areas of the clay. And then you want to set this aside to dry for the 12 to 24 hours as well. And then we will come and brush off all the extra pigment powder and see how it turned out. Here's the ring and it has had enough time to fully cure. I'm just going to brush it off with a soft brush. And there it is. I hope you like it. hope you give it a try. Remember to rate, comment, and subscribe. If you have any questions on this or any of my other crafts, go to my website at www.craftclutch.com and if you click on the link that says tutorials, you will be able to scroll through all the, the tutorials by pictures and find all the directions that you need. Thank you again for watching and we will see you next time. Happy crafting!